Hello accountability group. My name is Terrence Boylan with Packet Logics, and I thought I'd take you over a little tour of our office. All right. As you can see, it's snowing in lovely Warren, Rhode Island. These are our our offices. Let's see, this is a stainless steel room we use for doing access point installations in hospitals. Some of our certifications, our COVID-19 compliancy desk, just uh, different swag, things we give out, some awards, what have you. This is our conference table with a, uh, an air scrubber in the middle of it. This is um, actually not on right now, but it is a live uh, view of our ticketing system so we can all see what tickets are popped up and we can filter on those tickets whiteboard let's see that's just our conference room table there's our countdown timer for uh, the end of the quarter we have 39 days left there's Zach hiding there's hey. Zach and uh, Zach is our service delivery supervisor and uh, here's where our two techs sit fortunately their stuff is all clean which is great One's a training, one's with a client site right now. Uh, this is where we do some uh, videotaping uh, for our website and promotions, uh, that kind of thing. And uh, I need to, looking to do more and more of that now that we've got Zach on board. This is a neat little idea I got. It's uh, just a four by eight sheet of this Creo Soldier, something like that. Uh, anyway, it's like a thumbtack board. And I went to my local uh, auto garage shop and they gave me a bunch of these different little uh, th tag clear boxes clear clear tags and I stick everything for a different project in there uh, and then we've got you know do we receive an internal PO is the project scheduled is the project started and then for all, most of our projects we do a lot of wireless reporting uh, we have the report and is the report pending uh, and then after it's complete it's no longer on this board for projects um, behind here, we have uh, three different rows that I won't go into. The first one's kind of marketing and office supplies. The second one is uh, cabling and installation supplies. And the third one is uh, back stock for uh, access points, switches, some tools, uh, tower climbing harnesses. Um, you name it, it's randomized in there. There's our second office air scrubber this is our little uh, where we laminate and make books and cut things and all that good stuff um, all those red bins are documents that are about to they're going to be shredded shortly this is our tech room this is my lovely sign the client is always right even when you damn well know they're wrong I once worked for a company and the owner had that put up everywhere in the company. But this is where we uh, build computers or break them down or fix things or do anything that requires uh, anti-static work. Um, and obviously we keep, uh, trying to keep everything organized with incoming, outgoing, everyone gets, every piece of hardware should get a green sheet like this that will tell you who the owner is, what it's going, where it's going, what it's doing, that kind of thing. Um, I use these red bins, so that one red bin per, this is my old surface, so everything that the tech's going to need to fix that surface is in there, including materials, a heat gun to separate the screen, uh, power cables, you know, you name it, it's in there. Uh, this is another one for a new laptop we're getting for one of our employees and some stuff I want to give her when she picks it up. Um, we're really big into recycling, so I break everything down by old technology that we're just going to recycle metal uh, old batteries up here we've got uh, plastic hard rigid plastics I can recycle uh, PCB boards that uh, I recycle and scrap cabling that uh, we recycle um, we do get a little money from it it's really not much I use the uh, the funds for that just to buy drinks and stuff like that for the for the crew uh, these are files that desperately need to be purged that I'll get to someday this is my little office with my uh, my sitting desk, my standing desk, 
my mirror to make sure I'm smiling when I'm on sales calls because you sound a lot better when you smile and one big ass whiteboard and this is the end of the tour this is the kitchen and uh, some artwork by my mother-in-law oil paintings and more recycling I don't know I just figured I'd give you guys a tour for whatever it's worth see ya